Hey, 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 royal fans! Today's juicy headline Queen didn't meet Lilibet on video call after claims from Meghan and Harry's pals. The Queen did not meet Lilibet over video call as pals of Meghan and Harry claimed, as it is reported that the monarch will no longer stay silent over mistruths. In a dramatic departure from the established never complain, never explain policy, the 95 year old is said to have been sent over the edge by recent briefings by friends of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex to favoured US journalists. In the latest incident, it was claimed the Queen was introduced to the couple's second child, Lilibet Diana Mountbatten-Windsor, over a video call, but palace insiders say no such call took place, the Mail on Sunday reports. A source had told People magazine they were very excited and couldn't wait to share that their daughter had arrived, but a source has now told the Mail no video call has taken place. Friends of the Sussexes appear to have given misleading briefings to journalists about the, what the Queen had said, and that took the whole thing over the edge. And now further false communications will be dealt with robustly by the royal family. This is about whether or not they are being reported is an accurate version of what actually happened. The Queen was also shocked to hear that Harry had supposedly contacted her first to ask permission to use Lilibet, the monarch's nickname since childhood. The Mail on Sunday reported. The couple's spokesman told the New York Post he had spoken to his grandmother first and revealed his hope to name his first daughter in her honour. They added that if the Queen had not approved, Harry would not have used the name. But a senior palace source told the BBC the conversation was a telling, not an asking. The BBC account prompted a legal letter from Harry and Meghan's lawyers, which branded the story defamatory. The Queen's granddad, King George V, gave her the nickname Lilibet, after joking she could not say Elizabeth as a child, and Prince Philip later adopted it. Lilibet Diana Mountbatten Windsor's arrival was announced last Sunday, two days after Meghan had given birth on June 4th. In a statement on the couple's website, it stated that Lily is named after her great-grandmother, Her Majesty the Queen, whose family nickname is Lilibet. Her middle name Diana was chosen to honour her beloved late grandmother, the Princess of Wales. I don't know if that's true or not, but it is damn interesting. If it is mistruth and the Queen starts speaking out, it's going to just blow everything up. Oh, exciting times, as long as you're not part of the royal family. Leave your opinion, guys, down below. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching today's article. See you tomorrow with more, and a goodbye for now.